like this. But I can't afford a suit right now. Looks like I'm gonna have to pick up more shifts at the bowling alley. Not so fast, Eric. Who are you? That's not important right now. What matters is you looking sharp for your interview. How am I gonna do that? Just grab your computer and go to combatgent.com. Combatant Gentlemen provides high quality men's essentials such as suits, shirts, and ties directly to you without the retail markup. With Combatant Gentlemen, you'll have everything you need to make that lasting impression. Looking good, Eric. I'm gonna nail this interview. Be sure to click the link below to receive a free tie with your purchase. Combatant Gentlemen, dress smarter. Hey guys, I'm Vishal Melwani, co-founder and CEO of Combat Gentleman, and today we're going to talk to you guys about the perfect way to mix and match suit and tie combinations. Let's start over here uh, with the charcoal slim fit suit. The, the charcoal slim fit suit is a, is a perfect classic suit for the daily grind at work. Um, it's, not too, it's not too overbearing, but at the same time, it shows that you really care about choosing something other than navy blue or you know sometimes black at work. Uh, what we've done is we've teamed it up with a with a crisp white daily grind shirt, and you know that's perfect for just about any suit that we make, um, or just about any suit you may find. Um, but what's really important is that we've we've used a slim fit tie that really kind of brings out the color of both the shirt and the jacket, and that's really kind of key when you're trying to find the good the best tie pairing for your suit. You really want to find something that's going to bring out the shirt color first because that's really what the tie is doing. It's resting on your neck and it's really going to be drawing the attention of, of the person who's in front of you directly to you. So you really want to make sure that the combinations aren't overbearing uh, but at the same time are working together cohesively with the, with the overall outfit that you're putting together. Next up we have um, our gray uh, pinstripe slim fit suit. And this is a, a really cool suit because it's, it's dynamic. It's something that you can wear. Um, maybe you have a board meeting or maybe you have a couple of meetings lined up and it's something that really proves to uh, the person that you're wearing is that you take, you take your wardrobe seriously just like you take your job seriously. Um, and what we've done is we matched up the, the gray with a, a really cool light blue. And that's really, that's what's really cool about it is that gray is really versatile. It works with a lot of different shirt colors. And what we did was we teamed it up with this maroon tie to really kind of draw, again, draw the attention to the, the wearer's eye, but it really brings out the light blue in the shirt. That's super important. And what we've added is a, a small accent pocket square. We want to be sure that we never match our tie to our pocket square. I think that's one of the biggest uh, misnomers out there that's floating around the industry. Um, and again, it just, the whole package kind of draws it together and it's nothing is overbearing one another. It's really kind of congruent and it really, really brings the whole kind of outline of the ensemble together. And that's what we kind of go for, especially as we're talking about the daily grind and classic suits. And here we have the classic Navy. And this is um, one of our, I guess our highest sellers and really what's, what's, what's kind of really cool about the Navy suit is that it literally works everywhere and all the time. You can mix and match a lot of different things with it, whether it's a white shirt or we have a dark poplin on this one. Um, but what's really kind of important is the fact that we really want to be careful that we don't want to draw too much attention away from the overall darkness of the suit. So really you kind of try to find tonal colors that match with the navy suit. Try not to be too overbearing with the color. We see a lot of people who try to bring out too much color in the navy suit, which is again, it's too much impact on the chest. So what we've done here is we have a, uh, a navy suit with a darker navy tie with red accent striping and it really kind of brings the suit to life without kind of overbearing um, colors. Um, basically, you know, on all of these three, you really want to focus on accessories, but something that you can do for all of these three is uh, for accessories is in belts or shoes. You can go um, dark tan or black for belts or shoes. So you really want to make sure that the whole ensemble comes together and with gray and navy, browns, really dark browns, really tan browns, bring out the light in the suit and kind of add to the um, overall ensemble. So that's something that we would also tell our customers. So here we have a couple of different options if you want to take a, take the sartorial step up, I guess you could say, um, on mixing patterns on, on different kinds of suits. So here we have our gray slim fit. And what we've done is we've used a light blue striped shirt and mixed it with a knit tie that's polka dot. And what we've done here was we really tried to bring out um, the overall suit again. And, and we let the dark blue on the tie really resonate with the gray and kind of bring out the, the colors. And, and, and really what we like to say is don't be afraid to mix and match patterns. Just make sure they're not the same pattern. Um, so over here we have, like I said, we have a striped polka dot and then we have a micro pin dot um, for our pocket square. All different colors, but they all kind of belong to the same color palette. 
Um, and what this does is that it really kind of unites together and really kind of draws attention to the gray suit overall. And you know, something like this you would, you would do with a, a dark tan shoe, with a dark tan belt, um, and it would really kind of draw the whole outfit together really well. And this is something you could do for maybe it's a, a meeting outside of the office, maybe it's a, it's a big um, once a year style meeting, really something bold that you really wanna take that next step um, into fashion wise and just really kind of style wise. Um, over here we have a, a muted uh, Glen plaid pattern suit. Um, this, this suit actually offers something a little different. There's a ticket pocket in here, which is kind of more of an homage to like British tailoring um, that we will be dropping um, very soon. What we've done here is we really stepped it up in color wise. So you see um, there's a pink, um, window pane shirt with the pink polka dot knit tie um, that really kind of uh, blends together to bring out again the dark navy suit but you can really see the contrast between the navy suit and the shirt and all, all together it re looks really great and what we've done is we've added this um, kind of cream eggshell white uh, pocket square to kind of draw together just that extra hint of, of color and style. Um, what we say is that, you know, don't be afraid to, I guess, you know, venture out and kind of try different things. And spe specifically, we have the knit ties, 100% silk knit ties that are something different that you don't see in the office every day. But, you know, they are classics. They are kind of, you know, an homage to Mad Men, I guess you could say, but they really do kind of um, add a, a little extra step into that wardrobe to show that you, you do really care about what you're wearing and that you understand a little bit about style. Um, and, I, you know, I think these two are perfect examples of what it means to take that next step. I'm Vishal Malwani, CEO of Combat Gentleman, and thanks again for checking Combat Gent out with Art of Manliness. Uh, we look forward to talking to all of you on the site, www.combatgent.com.